Hello, welcome back to my channel. Uh, today, I'm gonna try a new filter on Bricks Builder, which is a render filter. Uh, this filter enables you to implement your own conditional logic display, conditional display logic for each element on the builder. So it will be something like this. Uh, I have uh, this button, the side in button, and this uh, button should only uh, visible or should only display for a non login user. And I have the model. Uh, let's uh, display it like this. So I have this login model a model for a uh, form login and these two uh, should be only a display for a non login user and then uh, I will have uh, another button that will only show for a login user so I'm gonna uh, create a welcome text something like hello and let's show the user uh, nickname the username where is that first name last name display name Then uh, let's see the filter how it work. So we only need to copy this function to our this function to our uh, function file.php or uh, to the plugin for execute the function code whatever you like whatever uh, it suit you need it suit your need I'm gonna paste this code on my functions in my temp child folder. So this is uh, my element ID. The return is user login. So the element I the, the, the element which has an ID uh, here will only show for the login user. So uh, this is my so this button this welcome text to the login user I'm gonna copy the ID it's it's really hard to to copy from the builder I'm gonna oops, I'm just gonna use a console to see the ID of the element Okay, this is my element ID. Just copy and pass to here. Don't forget to delete the bricks uh, prefix ID. So it should be like this. And then we're gonna create. A new statement if element ID is we're gonna see the ID of the side in button so this will only show for a non login user just copy this delete the prefix and add the operator for uh, the not operator so uh, if the user is not logged in this will show up the element the element for uh, the button for the side in will show up and then I need to I need the another 
a function to display uh, to display the model only for the non login user. So let's edit it fix. I don't know my local WP is so slow running on my machine. I should upgrade maybe my SSD or add more RAM. Right, this is my model uh, element. I'm gonna show it first, something like this. Oops. The, the open on new tab. It, sometimes it's not working. I don't know why. So this is the model element, uh, the, the, the container of my model. I'm gonna copy the ID <coughs> and there is a simple way, uh, more uh, simple simplicity way to 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 display and uh, to, to use uh, multiple function but I am not I'm not I am not I'm not sure how to do that and I'm just gonna copy here I s what? where is the ID here just copy then yeah it should only show for not for non login user, I think this is done. And let's uh, let's edit with bricks. I'm gonna show the. I'm gonna make the model uh, hide for a default. Not a hide. The CSS should be hide display uh, by using a display none. Wait. Oh, nice. Um, we're gonna hide. Where is the hide? Display none. Okay, right. Okay, let's see. Now we only have a uh, one button, which is uh, the welcome text and the user display name for a login. If it, if the user is login like this, but if the user uh, is a non-login user, is a guest. Uh, let's see on incognito. We have a sign in button and the now and end the 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 model uh, element. Okay, let's see. Let's try say again right 
I I I have not set the redirect for the login form. So I'm gonna just eh, so I'm gonna just to reload the page manually. All right. Okay. The filter is working. And mm, but I have to mention there will be a non-code conditional display display logic interface in the builder for on the future update. So if you think that uh, this code is complicated for you uh, you can just wait for the later update and i think this will be a good a good thing because yes uh, we need we are very very a need for this conditional display logic uh, feature There is more a uh, thing to do uh, by using this uh, re new render filter that you can read on the documentation. I will put the link below or you can browse through the academy.bricksbuilder.io and uh, you can learn about the PHP operator uh, in this website I'm learning too right now actually so uh, let's run together I think uh, thank you for watching and if you have any suggestion or question please comment on the comment box down below and thank you for watching and happy coding